Scammers often call, pretending to be bank workers. They try to trick us and take our money. Telemarketers also call to sell products. Some calls are silent, checking if your number works. Scammers might use these numbers later. Many don't know about phone settings that block these calls. In this video, I'll explain how to find these settings on your Android phone. You'll also learn how to turn them on. I'll show you a simple way to figure out who owns a phone number that called you. Imagine you missed a call from someone you don't know. Should you call back? Not always. Scammers sometimes use short calls to trick you into calling them. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and let's get started. Open the Settings app. In the search box, type Block Numbers. Click on Block Numbers. Switch on Block Calls from Unknown Numbers. This feature will clock all calls from private numbers or a number withheld. However, this method may not be suitable for everyone. For instance, a boss or a friend might call you from an unknown number that isn't saved in your contacts and you could miss their call. In such cases, it's better to enable another feature that blocks only the numbers of known scammers and telemarketers. Reload the settings app. In the search box, type caller ID and spam protection. Switch on caller ID and spam protection and then agree. Once this feature is enabled, if an unknown number calls you and it belongs to a scammer or a telemarketer, you'll receive a notification identifying it as spam. This way, you can decide not to answer the call. This feature uses a database of scammer numbers reported by other users, ensuring that calls from such numbers are automatically filtered. Finally, here's an easy way to check who called you and whether it's safe to call back. Open Google and type who called me followed by the phone number into the search bar. Scammers often use the same numbers to target multiple people, so there's a high chance that others have reported the number online. You'll find several websites where users share reports of scam and telemarketer numbers. Sorry, but I do not wish to promote one over the other. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to hit the like button below and share it with your friends. If you want to see more videos like this, click subscribe and join us.